Hello and welcome to this video on email engagement. My name is David Mockery and I'm a CRM consultant with Magnetism Solutions in Auckland, New Zealand. Magnetism Solutions is a gold partner for Dynamics 365. Email engagement is part of the new Relationship Insights feature in Dynamics 365 and we're going to talk today about what it can do. Um, I'm not going to focus on what needs to exist in um, Dynamics 365 for it to work, any of the prerequisites. I'm also not going to go into how to configure it, rather than going to go into how to use it. If you want to know how to configure it and the prerequisites that have to exist before you can use it, there's an excellent article on Dynamics Health and Training and the link is on screen now. So, email engagement. I send an email from CRM. Or Dynamics 365. I send it to this Ginger Seagal and the subject is this is really cool and if you check this out and I've got a link in the email. Now what you'll see with um, email engagement is this new section down here on an email saying, giving you the option to follow or not follow this email. And we'll come shortly to what that actually means. It gives you the option to send it later if you want to. Now you might use this option if you discovered that um, the person who you were sending it to um, likes to open up their emails or new emails at a certain time of day, then you could decide you wanted to send that at that time of day. So it puts it front and center for them when they're opening up their new emails. You can also set a reminder to follow up on emails within um, Dynamics 365. So let me just save this. And now I can put an attachment on it. So I'm going to um, choose a file. I'm just going to choose this, this uh, test one file. And I'm going to attach. Now I can, if I want to, follow the attachment. Now this is separate following the email. If I follow the attachment, it says to me here, choosing to follow attachment will upload the attachment to OneDrive for Business as a link. So if I follow it, and then I close that, so this is going to be, um, this email is going to be followed, and we'll just see what that means in a moment. And I'm following the attachment. I'm also going to set a reminder. And if I don't receive a reply, I can set the reminder to be if I don't receive a reply or if the email is not opened or I can set it to remind me anyway, regardless of what happens. Um, and when I want to be reminded by, I'll set this to be um, just in a, in a few minutes time. And I can put a comment in if I want to, but I don't have to. If I OK that then it tells me that it's going to remind me if this contact, Ginger Seagal, doesn't reply by that time. Now I'm going to send this email. Now this email is going to uh, my personal email box and it will arrive there shortly. Now here the email has arrived in my personal email box and as you can see the document there um, that isn't actually attached to the email, that is a link to OneDrive. And that was caused by following the email. Uh, you may remember there was a message in, um, in CRM that said if you follow the attachment, um, it will, it will, uh, the attachment won't actually be on the email. It will just be a link in OneDrive for this person to, to click on. And there's also that link that's in there as well. Now, if I go back to the email, um, Now, it does take a few minutes, but in a few minutes' time, um, I should see that the email has, in fact, been opened. But I won't see any attachment views, and I won't see any link clicks, and I won't see any replies. So let's give that a few moments to, to work. Now I can see, I've refreshed the screen, and I can see that there is one open. And it tells me that it was opened on a Windows 8.1 device. So you can even see what device they're opening on. Are they opening on the phone? Um, are they opening on um, on a desktop, etc. Now, if I go back to my um, my personal email and I 
open up the link. It will open up the Word document in Word Online. And there it is. It's just an empty document with a link on it. Um, if I click on the link itself in the email, now if I go back to um, back into CRM, shortly I will see the attachment and the link click appearing here. It hasn't appeared yet. It does take a few moments to um, sync with Exchange. And now you can see that uh, CRM is showing that um, the attachment was viewed and that the uh, link was clicked. And it gives you this timeline underneath which shows you what happened when, but it hasn't actually been replied to yet. Now when the reminder comes, comes around, um, then it will present a reminder um, card, um, an email engagement reminder card, um, in the same way as it shows other relationship assistant cards on the carousel, on the sales activity social dashboard, on what's new, um, on the what's new um, wall as well, um, reminding me that I, I have to um, uh, chase up this, this email because uh, the contact hasn't replied yet. And that's email engagement in, uh, in Dynamics 365. Thanks for watching.